What's up, YouTube? <clears throat> Anyway, um, I hope your day is going a lot smoother than mine was. This morning, um, I was riding my bike to work, and um, I got almost halfway to work, almost, not quite, almost halfway to work, when my handlebars snapped on my beach cruiser. That's why you don't see it here. I have it back at the bike shop so they can replace the handlebars. I mean, one day I was riding it to work, the handlebars were just, well, just fine, and um, well, that day I rode it home from work and the handlebars were loose, and it didn't make any sense because that day I rode it to work beforehand, you know, the um, handlebars weren't loose, but then as I was riding it home from work one day, they were loose, I'm like, what the fuck, so, man, whatever, you know. And then I didn't think to get them tightened up. I should have gotten them tightened up when I had the chance, but I didn't. And then today, like I said, I was riding my bike to work when the neck on my, you know how the, you've seen them, how they come up like ape hangers basically, right? Right here at the neck where they're screwed into the bike itself is where it snapped. Great. I'm sitting there going, what the fuck am I going to do? I'm like, I got to drag this shit back to the apartment and then get to work because, you know, that's what I was doing initially was going to work, right? And then some guy in his pickup truck with his dog, Rosie, stops and gives me a hand. He uh, had to put the bike in the back of his pickup truck, drove it back to my apartment, drove it back into my apartment. We then stopped and he got me a cup of coffee and a stick of jerky and what have you and gave me a ride to work, you know. I was totally not expecting the act of kindness that this person did, but then again, you know, last full of Sopranos is like that. Uh, you know, it makes you wonder if there are more people like that in the world today. There would be a lot less violence, but whatever, right? Uh, Ironic too, because he was wearing a Sons of Anarchy T-shirt. Let me see the bracelet I'm sporting here. Um, and then even more ironically, I was at work today, and um, a customer come in, and uh, she got a cute too. She had a <laughs> she had a Sons of Anarchy beanie on, and I complimented her on it. She's like, "Oh, thank you," and she smiled a little bright and pretty like. And I should have asked her her name. Damn it. Anyway, I got back from work and drove the piece of shit out of the, my apartment and over to the bike shop and hopefully they can uh, replace the handlebars. It shouldn't be too difficult. But, but yeah, man, this is some whack shit right here, straight up. You know what I'm saying? Like, it's fucking ridiculous, dude. You know? But it is what it is. So... Go ahead. 
to play that Metallica's version on, on the uh, computer here, and I'll sing along to it. But that's a nice way to open up the video with the national anthem, if I do say so myself. <laughs> um, <clears throat> go ahead and play the song here on the iTunes. I need to, I'm working on laying the guitar for it. And that's going to be a bit difficult, but it shouldn't be too hard. I mean, at least I got the first four notes of the opening right. <laughs> East of Omaha, listen to the end of all as one song. Think about the woman who will do the night of love. But this past will soon be wandering, the way they always do.
Regardless, you know, like I said, I can't say I'm too happy about the beach cruiser breaking again, but it's bad enough, you know, when engine wasn't working. Now the handlebars have to snap on me. Really? <laughs> but it is what it is. You know, there's no sense in stressing about it. Just get the issue fixed. And, I mean, at least the handlebars are on there and working properly like they're supposed to and not wobbling all over the goddamn place and awesome you know at this point i could get two shits less whether or not the engine works i just want to uh. When people are saying there's a string attached to this wand, do you see a string attached to this wand? Hmm. I don't. I mean, shit. You know, people are just like, you're faking it with that shit. I'm like, faking what, dude? You, you saw at the bottom of it. There's no string attached to it. I mean, come on now. Skills, my friend. Skills. That's what's up. I mean, really, it's it's one of the, and you seriously, there there is no string attached to this wand, you know. Oh, do you do you want uh, proof? You want proof? Look, do you see the bottom of this thing right here? Do you see it? Okay, no string attached. So. But I suppose non-believers will be non-believers, but that's all right. I really don't care. I'm just not too thrilled about the beach cruiser breaking. Shit happens, I guess, but it's easily fixable. If I go to new window and type in, let's see, chopper bicycle, let's see what comes up here. Oh, let's see what we got here. Let's see. Beach cruiser bicycles. Um, hmm. Some of these are pretty cool looking. I mean, if I have to get a new bike, I will, but try to make the one I have make it happen. You know what I'm saying? Like, I don't want to. I really don't want to get a new bike. <laughs> I don't. But if I have to, you know. Let's see what else. 
else do they got? Chopper bicycles. Oh yeah, these things are fucking sweet. Oof, 360 bucks for something like this. Hey, that'd be an expensive bike. But something like this would be pretty sweet to put a motor on, for sure. Yeah. This one's a little bit cheaper, it's oddly similar. So yeah, I don't know what, uh, but, you know, hopefully it won't take too long, and however long it takes to get it fixed, I don't care as long as it gets fixed again. I didn't know Bikeberry offered bikes. Actually, I knew, I knew that they did. Never mind. But so, in case you were, didn't have a bike to go with your kid, One review.
So <clears throat> that's pretty much what's <clears throat> Ooh, that, that's sweet looking. Damn. <clears throat> yeah, Blackberry's got some sweet bikes, I'm not gonna lie. Those are pretty cool looking. But <clears throat> I would be ever so cautious when buying from Blackberry because the kit I got didn't include a spark plug and was a pain in the ass to get on the bike and now it's not working. And I've, I don't know, I mean, I've called them several times and they've got back to me and said, we'll send you an email. And they send me an email <clears throat> to um, one of the YouTube videos in case you're having performance issues. And it's just, I don't know, it's not really helping me out anyway because it's not giving me the information I need. Well, supposedly it is, but... You know, it's just, uh, just not doing it. And it's kind of frustrating, you know, but, oh well. I mean, some people on this website claim to have had great service with these people. So, you know, I guess I just say if you're going to get a motorized bike, you know, be a bit more cautious on where exactly you're getting it from. So... Anyway, <clears throat> this is um, King Cobra JFS with another video, and um, thanks for watching, and I'll see you all later.